What is good on guys? My name is Kenji and welcome back to my channel. If it's the first time you're watching one of my videos, I'm a third year medical student studying at King's College London and I'm currently late for my train. Um, today I'm moving into my new accommodation in London. Um, I'm really late for my train, but I feel like it's been a while and I feel like we need to sit down and have a catch up over the last three months. So I'll speak to you guys in the next clip and I'll catch you guys uh, up on what's been happening in my life. So see you guys in the next clip. I'm one of your teenagers. Cool. So you'll be seeing me a lot of events. Great, great. Yeah, and um, can I ask you just to look at the events that are coming? Yeah. Uh, because we have neighborhood walks just to show you around and cool. free pizza party. Cool, so cool. yeah, just look look them. Okay, I'll be yeah. I'll be on there straight away. <laughs> cool. Okay, what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna show you the moon tree. Okay. So it's just that. from here. The dryer is up there, okay. the washing machine is down there. Cool. This is all controlled by an app called Circuit. So okay. please download Circuit, Circuit. on your phone. It, if you do it. want to use this, you can make payments via Circuit. Cool. You don't need coins or anything, it's okay. all done by the app. Oh, yeah? nice, nice. Garden. Yeah. Yeah. So if you just want to come and oh, nice. out and stuff. Wow. Okay, I like it, I like it. Nice. Okay. Okay, thank you very much. Did you need some help with the rest? Um, if possible, if possible. I, I could just do it in two goes if not. No, I'm fine. Um, sorry. Cool. So, yeah, oh, thank you, man. Help with Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Um, okay. No, I'm gonna go oh, you know, okay. okay, cool. Okay, so your room is gonna be scared. Nice. Probably nice view. Yeah, it should be nice. Um, so these are all the Wi-Fi instructions. Great. Yeah. Great. Also, what I really need to tell you what's really mm. important, every yeah. Wednesday yeah. in this building, mm. there's a weekly fire alarm test. Okay. It's at 1pm okay. every, right. every single Wednesday. Okay. If you hear that, yeah. for 60 seconds, yeah. it's fine. Okay. You can stay in your room. It's cool. fine. It's just a test. Cool, cool. If it's more than 60 yeah. seconds, yeah. please leave all your belongings in your room okay. and come out. And I wear the fire meter point. Yeah. If, if you if just before this building yeah. there's a street called Hampton Street okay. it would have been on your well if you're getting out of the building yeah. it's going to be on your left okay. yeah and that is where the fire meeting point is nice. and that's where you need to go but please do not use the lift and okay. just come straight out of the building no worries. Um, but that's only if it's longer than a minute if it's any other day then okay. please just come out come out alright cool <laughs> In my last foundation, it was like 10 a.m. in the morning, oh. which, is, which is crazy. Well, one thing was too bad. I know. There you go. Welcome Ooh, to Dream so Welcome. Ooh, There's nice. some um, things that you could check there thank for, you, so much. you know, to help you around the building cool. as well. Cool. And my and keys in here. Okay. Thank you so okay, much. Okay. You're welcome. Thank you very much. If you need anything, just let us know. Thank you very much. Available. Okay. And um, reception staff are here 8 to 8. Great. And um, from 8 p.m. to 8 a.m. there's always security on site. Perfect. And if you want to come downstairs to have breakfast, there yep. is some breakfast available. Right now? Downstairs. Oh, yeah. amazing. Okay. Do you want to come with us? Uh, I'll come in a bit, actually. I'm just going to settle down. Whenever you're settled down, just come cool. down. Cool. Thanks so much. Yeah. Thank you, man. I appreciate no it. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Thank you. So we're here now, just got into my room. Uh, as, you guys have as you guys can tell, it's literally my first 10 seconds of being here. So let's check it out. All right, so, got the door right there that I just walked in from, I guess this is the toilet. Let's have a look, let's have a look. Nope. Yeah, all right, so here's the toilet. <clears throat> got my, oh, I actually have a shower this time, oh my God. All right, so in my last accommodation, in um in Great Dover Street apartments, which you guys may have seen um in my last one of my last videos, I didn't actually have a real shower. So this, this honestly makes me so happy to have a real shower. I know it sounds stupid, but honestly, all right, sinks right here. <clears throat> then as you walk in, got my bed over here, which looks a bit bigger than my last one actually. I think this is like one and a half, like one and a half times. I think like one and a half size beds. 
Um, my last one was really, really small, so that's really, really nice to have. Got like cupboards up here as well. A huge desk. This oh man, this this desk is actually huge. I'm, I love it. I love it. Got some drawers over here, and yeah, I guess that's a courtyard area. Damn. So okay, okay, I like it. I like it. Um, yeah, it's actually really nice to be here. I was really excited to see my room. Um, so I'm really glad that it's actually it's a, it's a lot bigger than my last accommodation. Like if you haven't seen my last accommodation, go watch the tour video that I made. Um, but I will make a tour video of this accommodation if you guys want. So leave a comment down below if you want to see uh, where I'm at right now. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna chill out for, for a little bit. Like, you know, I'm, I'm really, really sweaty from like carrying all my bags. I wanna chill out for a little bit, um, put my stuff down, like arrange my stuff everywhere. And then, uh, yeah, see what else is happening for the day. Yeah, to let you guys know uh, what the plan is for us today, um, it's currently um, five past 11 a.m. So I think I'm gonna head to campus, head to the library for a couple of hours. My next lecture is, or my first lecture of the day is at 2 p.m. in Denmark Hill campus. I'm not entirely sure if I wanna go for it yet. I might just watch it online because I have a lot of stuff to do today. Um, but I might go to lectures from 2 to around 6 p.m. or 5.30 p.m. And then after that, I'm gonna rent a car and go pick up the rest of my stuff. Um, so this is literally what I brought from my last place I was staying at. Um, I was staying in Northwest London. Oh yeah, I just realized I haven't, got, I haven't actually like caught you up, uh, caught you guys up in the last couple of months. Okay, I'm gonna take a breather, rewind uh, a couple of days, rewind a few hours. Um, but basically over the last three months, I've been traveling around Southeast Asia. Um, so I went to Kenya first in Africa, then I went to Taiwan for four weeks. I posted a vlog on that, uh, my Taiwan vlog, go watch that if you haven't watched it yet. Uh, I went to Taiwan, I went to the Philippines, I went to Japan, I went to Bali, I went to Hong Kong, uh, and I got back from traveling last week, Saturday. Um, so it's been about uh, just over a week. Um, I started my third year of medicine last Monday, uh, so a week ago. And yeah, here I am in my new accommodation, uh, back in uni, back in the sw into the swing of things, back to making videos most importantly. Um, and yeah, so I left half my stuff uh, at my friend's house. Uh, literally all I bought, this is literally what I've been traveling with for the last three months. This suitcase right here and my little backpack over there as well. Uh, so, this is, so this is what I had with me um, for the last uh, week while I was staying with my sister in Northwest London. Um, so the rest of my stuff is at my friend's house. So later on today, after my lectures, I'm gonna go uh, rent a car and go pick up the rest of my stuff. I have like a huge bunch of boxes that I need to pick up. So I might actually rent a van. Uh, so I'm gonna rent a van, take you guys with me, go pick up my stuff later on after all my lectures, probably hit gym today as well, uh, and see what we have planned for the rest of the day. So I'll see you guys in the next shot. I've got to say that when you guys first move into your accommodation, you get like a bunch of free stuff as well. And to be honest with you, the reason why I pay all of this money to stay in accommodation is for all this free stuff here. So I'll show you guys what to expect. All right, so this is definitely worth the like 10 grand you pay per year to live in this place like this. Uh, so over here, let's see what's inside. Okay, okay, okay. All right, we've got pot noodle, which I'm sure will come in handy uh, one of these days. Maybe tonight, actually. Pot noodle over here. Oh my gosh, some hand sanitizer. Nope, nope. Some face wash, okay. All right, you never know. Don't mind some face, face wash. Some cards as well. All right, playing cards, I like that. Some drink me chai, some chai latte, okay, I like it. Ooh, oh, I love these things actually. It's one of these like sticky things that you can um, use to like um, stick stuff in your wall, like picture frames and stuff. That really comes in handy. Uh, clean energy drink, all right. Okay, energy drink, I like that. What else we got? Another one, all right, two energy, energy drinks. All right, I, see what I'm, I definitely see why I'm paying all this money now. Nando's, okay, some Nando stuff. Oh my gosh, yes. What is this? Oh, I've only got one hand, it's really hard to open this, hold on. Okay, some Nando's Perrine sauce and, oh, I had this last year actually. I think it's one of those free, like Nando's quarter chicken things, let's see. Uh, Let's see. Yeah, free half chicken and Nando's, oh my gosh. This is why we come to stay in accommodation, guys. All right, what else, what else we got, what else we got in here? Uh, hanger, all right. Some Reese's, is it Reese's, what's it called? Reese's, Reese's chocolate, okay, why not? And a bunch of cards over there. All right, I like that, I like that. Let's see what else is in here. Nice little bag and King's water bottle, which I have, I have like 10 of these already from the gym. All right, why not? What else have we got? You know what, let's just... Let's have a look. Okay, some cards, some more like, uh, okay. 
All right, so some leaflets and shit, leaflets and stuff. All right, a little keychain. All right, I'm, I definitely prefer that prefer that box to what's in there. But yeah, that's what you guys get in university when you first come. Um, look forward to it. Oh, I didn't notice this. All right. This, oh man, I love this. There's so much storage here. Like compared to my old place I was staying at, honestly, like there's so much more storage here, like up here as well. I love it. Um, I just realized I haven't actually gone to see the kitchen. Uh, so let's go check out the kitchen real quick. All right, hopefully none of my flatmates are here because if I walk into the kitchen for the first time with a camera, they're definitely gonna be like, what the hell, like who's this weirdo? Um, outfit of the day, by the way, got some oversized Boohoo Man uh, shirt on. Got some gray skinny jeans that I got yesterday in Westfield and the usual vans on as well. Anyways, let's go check out the kitchen and see what else this flat is saying. Is this this way? Ooh, okay. Okay. Oh, there's some lights on. Oh, I love this. All right. So we actually have a sofa area for the first time. In my old accommodation, we didn't have anywhere to like sit down and chill. So I like that. I can eat my breakfast there. Got like this whole section over here, like a really open plan, really nice open plan kitchen. Uh, I guess we can have our breakfast and like eat lunch over here and stuff like that. Two sinks as well, okay. Two, two places to cook. All these cupboards right here. Oh man, this is really nice. Um, two fridges, two freezers, all right. Yeah, two fridges, two freezers right there. I like the color as well, like it's all yellow and gray. I like the kind of color, uh, color scheme right here. No TV though. Online they did say there was a TV, so they kind of mugged me up on that. But um, yeah, that's pretty much it. So another tip when you first go to university, if you're the first one in the flat, make sure like you occupy as much space as possible. So I'm gonna literally go and bring my suitcase in here. I wanna unpack all my stuff and like hug all these cupboards here so no one can take them. Uh, only joking, but definitely <laughs> don't take all of them, but definitely if you're the first one in the flat, try and like reserve the best you know, kind of spot um, in the fridge and in the cupboards as well. I know it sounds really bad, just a little tip, um, take it or leave it, but I'm definitely gonna choose the best cupboards in here uh, in a few minutes. So yeah, I like this kitchen, I like it. Oh, Okay, right, just pop myself out. Lovely. Right, another major key to university. If you go check out your flat, make sure that you bring your key with you. I just locked myself out and I'm gonna have to go and ask for a new set of keys and I'm gonna look like an absolute idiot, but it's what it is. All right, so I'm already, um, I kind of spent a bit of time just settling down, like putting my stuff away, putting stuff on the floor, unpacking like a few stuff that I have on me. Uh, it's currently uh, 11 o'clock and I'm gonna head to campus. I wanna to go to the library, get a few hours of work done, um, meet, up, meet up with some of my friends for lunch, and then um, head to lectures at 2 p.m., I think. Don't hold me to it, but maybe 2 p.m. I might head to the lectures. Um, that's the plan so far. So I'll see you guys on the next shot when I'm in university. Alright, so here is the van. Let's work out how to open it. Let's see. Uh, drive. Unlock. Yeah. Nice and cozy. All right, so I just picked up the van um, and this isn't a sponsored post at all. I just really, really like support this company. 
Um, but I use this app called Zipcar, which is basically an app that allows you to rent cars or vans per hour. Um, so renting this van for like one hour, it's cost me like 10 pounds. Uh, so yeah, I picked up the van, really, really, you have to be 23 years old to, uh, to rent a van uh, and a car as well. Um, but whenever I need a car or a van in London, I literally just use this and it's absolutely amazing. So in the van now, uh, gonna drive over to my friend's house, uh, pick up pick up um, all my stuff and then go pick up Amin. Um, one of my friends Amin said he'll be helping me out uh, to unload all my stuff. So that's the plan for now. Right, first things first, gotta try to find out how to find these keys. Because uh, although the app opens up the, um, the van, it doesn't actually show where the keys are. So I'm guessing it's in the dashboards. Yep, in the dashboard somewhere. It's also got to put on the, uh, find, find the aux cable, try to put on some music. Yeah, there is an aux cable, so. Okay, my friend lives around um, 0.5 miles away. Should be around 10 minute drive, which isn't too bad. The traffic in London is normally quite bad around this time, so we'll see how that works out. And there is nowhere to put my phone, which is really annoying. Uh, but sorry, we'll work it out. Right, let's go. Yeah, driving a van this big as well is gonna be so hard. It's on, you can't tell on the camera, but it's honestly such a, like a huge van. So I'm not looking forward to it, but we'll see how that goes. <clears throat> the last time I drove a car was literally like three months ago. Alright, back in the car now. Uh, extremely sweaty after that, very, very hot. Um, but I'm gonna go pick up Amin now. Amin said he'll come and help me out. So I'm gonna put him, I'm gonna put the address in, go find him, pick him up, and then unload all of this stuff. Like I'm sweating, I'm, I'm, I'm like panting so much as well. Um, but yeah, I have about half an hour until I need to return this, this van. And I'm really hoping I have enough time to like pass by like a McDonald's drive through and get like a smoothie or like a milkshake or something. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next uh, part of the vlog. Coming down Shree, come down with some stuff. Uh, yeah, I think there's a bag in, in um, Shree's room. Would you mind grabbing that? Yeah, we'll do. See you in a bit. Yo, yo. <laughs> I think he's safe, bro. It'll be like from Bali to Bali's <laughs> ends. <laughs> Alright, drop in, bro. Whoa, wait. You're the vlog, Julia. Oh. See in that spot right here. <laughs> bro, this goes nowhere. It's, it's completely dark, you can't even see. Alright, no worries. Alright, thanks, guys. Safe. Bye. So, you, you come lecture tomorrow? Yeah, yeah. 10 a.m. Alright, see ya. Be there, be square. Alright, see ya. Safe. Thank you. Alright, so. <laughs> Am I oily? Gosh, I'm so shiny. Give me one sec. All right, so I'm finally back in my, my room and oh my gosh, am I tired? Like, it's been a really, really long day. Uh, to kind of catch you guys up, uh, as you can see, the box is right behind me. Um, I finally am completely moving to my accommodation. Um, in the last clip that you guys saw, I was in the library, I think. Oh, let me just straighten this out. In the last clip that you guys saw, I think I was in, I was in the library. Um, after that, I went to um, King's College Hospital. Uh, we had a number of lectures there. I think we had six lectures in total, which are around 30 minutes each. Um, so we had like three or four hours of lectures, got the lectures out of the way, and then I caught up my friends and we took a bus to uh, Nando's. Uh, so we had Nando's, like we sat down, caught up as well, uh, which is really, really nice. And then after that, I went and I rented a van, as you guys, um, as you guys saw in the last few clips. I rented a van. Went to pick up all my stuff, then picked up Amin and Julia, and they helped me move into my new flat. Uh, so here we are. Uh, on the way home as well, I picked up uh, KFC. I know this is like a medical channel, but I want to keep it real with you guys. And I know I go to gym and I promote this whole gym, like, like lifestyle and medicine lifestyle. I'm gonna keep it real with you. Um, I really cannot be bothered to like go to the kitchen right now and cook food. It's already um, 9.30 p.m. No, 10 to 10 p.m. And I have lectures tomorrow morning and I need to like unpack all of this. Like, I don't know if you guys can see this, but there's like, there's boxes on boxes. I'll, I'll give you guys like a, I'll show you guys in a sec, but so many boxes I need to unpack and I really did not feel like, uh, you know, going to cook food. Uh, I also passed by Tesco's and I picked up like a few essentials that I need like to last me till tomorrow. I'm not entirely sure like how much I packed here, like how many like, you know, kitchen stuff I packed. So I wanted to get a few things. So I got like um, antibacterial wipes for like cleaning up in my room. I got like um, washing up liquid as well. <clears throat> 
I got uh, shampoo, uh, some like um, shower gel as well, and what else did I get? I also got <coughs> some brioche buns. I live off these things. Like if you guys see my day in the lives, uh, day in the life videos, I absolutely love these things. I live off them. Uh, so yeah, <laughs> the plan is right now to eat my dinner. Uh, I'm gonna call one of my friends, catch up with him as well, eat my dinner, and then like unpack all of his stuff. So I'll just show you guys right now like how much stuff I actually have to unpack. Um, so my suitcase right here was what I brought it with me today. I have all of his stuff here, like my you know other more suitcases. I have um, boxes on boxes and boxes and boxes and boxes. Uh, some like little bags over there as well. Um, some boxes over here as well on my you know on my table. So there's like there's a, there's a lot to do like tonight. Like it's already as I said 10 to 10 p.m. It's already 10 to 10 p.m. and I have lectures tomorrow morning at around 10 p.m. back in the hospital. So I'm gonna try and like unpack what I can. Try like at least find like my you know my um, my bedding, uh, the things I need to like sleep on. Um, <laughs> that is the plan for now. And then, uh, yeah, I'm gonna eat real quick and then I'm probably gonna end the vlog there. So I'll speak to you guys in the next clip. Um, oh, and lastly, none of my flatmates have actually moved in yet. Um, because I'm a third year medic, the medics start um, around, I think, one or two weeks earlier than everyone else. So all my flatmates should be moving in uh, next weekend. Um, so right now I have the whole flat to myself, hopefully, uh, for the next week at least. Uh, so yeah, that's the plan. I'm gonna eat dinner <laughs> and then wrap up the vlog. I'll speak to you guys in about two seconds. All right, so it's currently around uh, midnight and the packing is finally done. Like, I literally can't describe to you guys just how tired I am, but I'm so happy to be done. Um, my room is more or less, like, in place. Like, I still need to make it a bit more pretty. I still need to, like, put stuff away, but it's more or less in place. So I'll just show you guys real quick how it's looking at the moment. Okay, so as I said, I still need to kind of, like, put stuff away, but I have my, um, my tablet over there with the keyboard. I have the um, my laptop set up to the monitor over there, uh, to my TV, I mean. Another little kind of like cupboard down there. Up here is all my stuff that I've kind of laid out at the moment. Um, so I'll just leave it up there for now. Over here is the bed. Uh, so as I said, it's a double bed now, which I'm so, so happy about. Um, and yeah, just, that's pretty much it. Oh yeah, my guitar down here as well. So that is pretty much it. Uh, I'm really, really happy with my room, as I said. Uh, but before I end the vlog here, I wanna kind of go downstairs and just do a bit of exploring. Like earlier on, I saw a bit of the common room, I saw a bit of the study room, but I didn't actually get to like see what it's actually like. So before I end the vlog, I'm gonna take you guys down with me. Let's just go check it out. There might be some people in the common room now, right now, which I can meet. Uh, I'm not entirely sure, it's quite late. Oh, before I go downstairs, let me show you guys the uh, wall of achievement right now. Uh, so up there, I've got my degree. Down here, I've got my uh, graduation day as well. And down here, um, I have my first publication. So it's kind of nice just having it like near my desk over there. It's really nice just to kind of have a bit of a reminder of you know what I can achieve if I work hard. So I'm gonna put my shoes on right now uh, and show you guys downstairs. Uh, yeah, let's just go ahead. Yeah, here it is. I'm not entirely sure if you guys can see this, it's kind of dark, but this is actually so sick. Like we have, you know, benches here just to chill out. Um, we have a pool table over here, uh, small benches, um, place to keep my bi our bikes. That's my bike over there in green. Um, moving down here, we have like some chill chairs over here, like kind of beach chairs. Uh, we have a table tennis table over here. I know it's really dark. We have table tennis over here. Uh, over there, we have like picnic benches and stuff. Um, and there's like a little canopy area over here. Oh, this is actually so cool. Like I, I absolutely love this. Like I definitely can see myself just chilling here in summer, like having a beer with my friends, having a drink with my friends, chilling outside, playing table tennis and stuff. This is this is actually so sick. Like I'm not entirely sure if you guys can see this before. It's, it's quite dark, but definitely looking forward to spending some more time here. So I'll see you guys in the next shot. Here's a study room. Um, there's like loads of little desks over here. Um, they're all in, like high chairs, which is really, really cool. Um, yeah, here's the study room. There's like desks over here, desks over there. So many chairs. Um, there's also like a TV up here as well, which I guess is like connect your laptop and like work on. Um, but yeah, this is honestly like, this is honestly amazing. Like I can definitely see myself like coming here to work. Like instead of going all the way to campus uh, to, you know, to go to the library. If I can't bother to go to the library, I can definitely see myself like just chilling here. Uh, also when my friends come around, Okay, I'm not entirely sure what that is. 
Also, when my friends come around as well, we can all just come down here together and just work like in a group, which I really, really like. I'm definitely the sort of person that like needs a working environment. Like I don't really like working in my room. Uh, I don't really like working at home. Uh, I really, really need an environment to work in. I used to work in like coffee shops over summer and, and stuff like that. But I really, really like much prefer an environment to just sit down where I can just like dedicate to my work. So having this here is absolutely priceless. And honestly, it probably is the best thing about this accommodation. Having this area here is absolutely amazing. So that is the tour, guys. Um, I want to conclude the video here. Um, I really hope this video has been informative. I know it's kind of like a chill day, uh, not really like very, very informative at, at all, actually. But hope it gives you guys like an experience of what it's like to actually move into university halls. I was a bit hesitant to like record this video because I don't want to be that guy that has a camera, like meeting new people and stuff like that and walking into a new area. But I had to do it for you guys. Um, so if you're going to university very, very soon, let me know what you're really looking forward to. I remember like when I was first moving into my very, very first student accommodation ever, I was really nervous. I was also really looking forward to it. So let me know with a comment down below what you're looking forward to. If you have any questions at all about the accommodation or where, you know, or what it's like to move into university, do let me know and I'll make sure to get back to you. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching this video and I'll see you guys on the next one.